Hey guys, Tim here from Legion v Paddock and today I have a review for you guys. It's a juice review. It's been so long since I've done a juice review but basically I did, I did not do any juice reviews because I haven't found any that is actually pretty much interesting, alright? But today I have two e-liquids that's pretty darn good. Uh, this is uh, from VapeTat, okay, uh, Ken. He contacted me recently on Facebook, uh, I mean on YouTube I think, he private messages, messaged me, uh, met up with me, passed me this two e-liquid. Uh, talk to me about uh, talk to me about the brewer. Uh, he's he has a store that sells uh, this illiquid. It's called facebook.com slash Odashi vapes. I think okay uh, Link will be here and also in the description if you guys want to buy it price 40 ringgit Okay, this this two illiquids are pretty darn good the price. Okay, uh, it's it's cheap. Okay, it's cheap 30 mil bottle 6 milligram nicotine uh, I've got this about three days ago and it's half gone all right so i'm gonna vape these two uh, liquids on two different drippers one is the ceo dripper by uh it's a ceo dripper and one is a sod 5k dripper okay both single coils both at about 0.5 ohms all right so let's have a vape the first one it's called cows okay cows is a strawberry apple vape when i first heard of strawberry apple vape, i was like here we go again strawberry apple vape your typical strawberry apple Apple vape. But what Ken told me is this brewer actually uses uh, US based fla flavoring, okay? And when I heard that, I was a bit, still a bit skeptical, right? But when I put this in my, my dripper and I dripped it and I tasted it, you can taste the difference, okay? You can taste the difference. Uh, the strawberry, it's a very juicy, sweet uh, strawberry, a bit sourish. Uh, I believe the apples in here is red apples because it's a bit of a more sweeter apples, especially on the exhale. You can you can get that appleish uh, taste, and it's fantastic. Okay, it smells like red apple too. It's good. Okay, it, it can definitely chuck them vapor too. I'm using um, my Sick Green Tank Crossing mod, uh, dual eighteen six fifty, uh, freshly charged too. You can definitely chuck the vapor and the flavor on this is just great okay it's a menthol vape it's very icy if you guys are not a huge fan of very cold vapes this is not a vape for you but in from in my opinion this is definitely daily vape material okay this thing can be uh, one of my favorite vapes is really really good a uh, throat hit on a on a dripper it's it's good okay six milligrams it's not very strong but it's definitely there and it's definitely nice all right Ken told me also that um, this juice is uh, one of the best-selling ones, and I can see why. Okay, it's it's not something you can hate. I don't think anyone can buy this and hate it unless you do not like a uh, menthol. All right. So yeah, that's about it for this uh, juice. Uh, very very nice. Okay, I, I really like this, especially for the price forty dollars. No brainer. Okay, very very cheap. Next, I'm gonna do. It's called rins okay rins what is rins this is so far my favorite vape of 2015 but it's only february but seriously this thing is good stuff all right what it is on the description ken told me it's avocado custard and when i first heard avocado custard i was like i was happy because it's it's something new in the market something not a lot of people do a lot of people do blackcurrant mints a lot of people do strawberry custard a lot of people do honeydew mint but i never heard of avocado custard before um i don't vape uh, american blend illiquids because I can't afford them simple as that all right so i do not know if avocado custard actually exists but this is avocado custard and oh my god this is good okay i'm gonna drip some in there because it's drying out and it is a fantastic vape right uh, the, the, I'm not sure what the PG VG ratio on both e-liquid is what I'm guessing is a 50 50 due to uh, looking at just the viscosity but it's fantastic all right let me have a vape see the vapor production very nice vapor production all right um the flavor all right inhale hits you really nice 
avocado okay avocado if you guys do not know what avocado is i'm i don't know how to explain it's a fruit it's a fruit that has no taste but a very strong smell people eat it with milk or in malaysia they blend it uh, put it on some cakes and all those stuff right and it's great okay i'm not a huge avocado fan to be honest with you guys i do take like avocado ice cream uh, I have avocado cakes a bit of avocado milkshake but i do not crave avocado but this one is maybe it's just because it just strike me so hard because i just did not expect a vape like this okay and, and the inhale is just avocado and then it fades to this really nice custard a uh, creamy custard uh, sweet vape and then um, on the dripper I don't really taste it much but on a K fun I do taste a bit just a slight hint of banana in the end okay I'm not sure if there is banana in this illiquid but I do uh, maybe it's just the avocado mixed with custard it came out this banana aftertaste and I love it okay I am a huge banana fan and it just suits it for me okay i've been vaping like i run i ran about six tanks from my k fun already and it's fantastic after about three two days of using it yeah it it gunked my uh, wick because you know it's kind of a brown illiquid but it it, it 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 does taste absolutely fantastic okay it's something different something unique something i'm not not everyone has in the market and it just vapes really really well I pick this up every single day when I pick it up and I vape it I was like no way in hell the avocado will be there again I just put it in and vape it and the avocado gets me every single time my girlfriend loves this illiquid she's planning to buy like tons of this and it's, it's just, just very very interesting nice flavor the only complaint I have about these two illiquids is the throat hit because on a dripper it's sufficient okay it's smooth sufficient not very thumping smooth but but by right if it's six milligrams on a dripper it should hit pretty hard for me because other illiquids if i try to put in my dripper i'm gonna cough okay i'm gonna cough i only can vape uh, on a dripper about four four to three milligrams of nicotine so this one is smooth for me it's either my throat adjusted to six milligrams or it's just not enough okay on my k fun i barely feel anything okay so I just wish the the brewer maybe uh, come come up comes up come out with um, maybe nine milligram or twelve milligram uh, variant of uh, the illiquids, especially for people who like tanks. Okay, like uh, K funds, uh, Thai funds, and all this stuff. Uh, they want a, a stronger thumb, uh, less vapor, of course, because of the stronger thumb. That's why we want a, a, a stronger throat hit. And hopefully, the brewer can actually uh, put out a liquid that actually has that that thump because. I enjoy this a lot on my K fun. Okay, I do not like dripping at all. So, you know, K fun, please brewer, watch this video. Hopefully, you watch it. Uh, I want to order some, and I want a strong throat hit. Okay, not too strong, but you know, US based six milligrams of nicotine. That's what I want. Okay, I want a solid thumb to the throat on my K fun. But on a dripper, fine enough for me. bloody good vape all right a bloody good vape so yeah that's about it for this review where to get this facebook.com slash odashi uh vape something i'm gonna put a link here fantastic illiquid fantastic price uh the price stunned me i was expecting about 50 ringgit but it's 40 ringgit it's a no-brainer guys okay no-brainer if you guys want to try something new this is the one to go okay it's pretty darn good okay vape tat uh fantastic job so yeah that's about it for this review go to my page facebook.com slash malaysian vape for more reviews and peace Oh!